Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode of Hearts of Iron 3 for the Motherland, Turkey. Now, where were we? Oh yes, before we start, let's go to here and let's just... Let's just uh, get rid of that because apparently people complained about having two engineers in an anti-tank thing, anti-tank uh, brigade, whatever. So I'm gonna say this to you: you choose. After well, after I do this army, uh, after I build this anyway, because I found out that it's mountain plus. I do infantry. Oh yeah. I'll do all mountains for this. I'll do three mountains. Just so we have a proper IRC. I see, I mean. So, anyway, uh, you choose what uh, uh, infantry I have next, uh, what people I create. And I'll call it a YouTube army or whatever. It doesn't not matter to me. So. Okay, first of all, let's actually look at the situation here. God, I love it. Okay. Economic boost due to a surge in produ uh, productivity. Our factories are currently producing more goods, although we are not sure how long this will be sustained. War harder, not smarter. If I sound weird, it's because I'm sick. Hope they get what Iraq. Ah, oh, I see what happened. The British are taking over Persia. Ah, uh, and Japan is taking over everyone. Really, it's not a war with. Yeah, it's yeah, it's Japan is doing what it usually does. Usually, I stress usually. But yeah, so anyway, oh my god, the voice sounds so bad. What the hell just happened? The attack? This is a weird game. Being a weird, really weird game. Okay, let's, now, like I was saying before, let's go to diplomacy. 60%, sweet. 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 <laughs> Soon I can join. And yes, now we got. Now we just gotta wait for these two things, and then I can get medium, and then I will stop and start working on. Uh, okay, let me rephrase that. After I research all of this so I can get medium brigade, I'll stop there for a while, then go back to industry and try to increase this basically so I'm not kind of laid behind on anything and basically improve everything. So yeah, hope that made sense. Sure. Ah, uh, Rep oh yeah, they won, so Republican Spain, how? Quite disappointing and yep, yep. Germany is taking over everyone. What? Oh, oh, I get it. Uh, okay, it's playing out like a normal game then. So soon... 
if France will be taken over, then... I really gotta get into this war really, really fast. It's a puppet. Okay. Sweet. Uh, to be honest, right now it's just a waiting game. Yes, the waiting game. And yes, we need to fix up our shit. Get our shit together. But yes. Okay, do you know why? You must be thinking. Why did I? What? Oh shit. Shit. Damn. Okay. <laughs> well then. That was quick. And what? They weren't even. They were infantry, basically. Yes, okay, okay. Yes, you, okay, like I was saying before, you're wondering why I was building a mountain here? Because this is basically mountains. If you go, not terrain, uh, this. Okay, besides this, but basically everything here is hills and, and when Germany basically invades. Okay, okay, I'm gonna read this because this is something interesting. So we can see. Okay, sorry if I hit the mic, but anyway. France, the Vichy regime. Shortly after taking over from Paul Renaud on the 17th of June 1940, what a what? Set about establishing a longer term pol uh, political relationship with Germany. The armistice was a necessary, f necessary first step in both. Avoiding further bloodshed and in establishing a better relationship with a Germany that would, according to the Vichy's ministers and Petrain himself, soon defeat Great Britain and become the, the dominant power in Europe. Some spoke, in fact, of I'm not going to say that a Europe dominated by Germany. His ministers thought that France, as a colonial power and a major influence on Europe between the wars, would be well uh, would be well placed to become an important ally to this powerful nation in the heart of a new European order. I'm not going to say that. <laughs> a strong government. The French state was created on the 17th, uh, 12th of July 1940, and some form of cooperation with the German uh, with Germany would be necessary precaution for this. Okay. Sweet. Vichy France. Uh, most people wouldn't last six weeks. Okay. Our finest hour. With France defeated, most people figured that Britain wouldn't last another six weeks. They underestimated the spirit of the British people and their government. They bore themselves that if the British Empire and its Commonwealth lasted for a thousand years, men would still say this was their finest hour. Okay, shame of defeat. God, all these pop ups. France has fallen and the shame of defeat burns in our souls. It is time to rally all true Frenchmen to the cause. France can redeem, can be redeemed, and will be redeemed. The flame of the French resistance will not be extinguished. <sighs> so long, and my throat is killing me. So, okay. Oh, they taken over. Oh, uh, they took over from. 
and they are New Zealand. We would give that. Oh. I'm just thinking. Sweet. No, not yet. But anyway, okay, so that's gonna go up. Reliability. Armor and gun. Sweet. And then I can go and do it. What can I do? Advanced construction. You know what? Uh, hmm. Shall I do research efficiency? Uh, hmm. We shall do. You know what we shall do? We'll probably go with this when we have enough. Yes. Okay. Let's hope this is not a game where basically Japan. Mm -hmm. They're mobilizing. Don't be against me, hopefully. For the love of God, don't be against me. Uh, Italy's losing, huh? This is funny to me. And they were winning there, now they're losing? Or something? Oh my god! Damn it! <laughs> uh, really, that's... Uh, no, this is why... one I guess once we once we've done that. Give us bias. But yeah all I can see happening is oh god the Fitchy France they have that. Uh, at least I can technically Oh, it's guaranteed by Germany. Oh, uh, well, doesn't matter. If America gets involved and pushes them back. Well, then, hey. Okay. 
Okay. My voice sounds really bad. Sorry, guys. It's, it's it sucks today. It sucks. thinking about why do I have this here but yeah at least at least at least it's cool at least we have proper Sweet. Now we got that there. We can get rid of that. And I can... There. Put it to our right number. That was the weirdest sound I've ever made. Woo! <laughs> uh, just need to get there, then I can invade. Okay. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. Once we get down to 30, we're gonna join the Axis and we'll probably be invited to their war. So we're gonna we're gonna have to basically We're gonna have to take on Iraq and the United Kingdom at the same time, but let's hopefully say that Japan gets involved. <laughs> uh, embargoed by. Okay. So the union is. Why do they move us, by the way? Ah. Uh, okay. I don't know why they mobilized, but they mobilized anyway. So. Doesn't matter to us anymore now. Damn, my, my plans for an Ottoman Empire seem limited now. Like, sure, I probably can get a lot of this area and then go down here. Saudi Arabia. Okay, you're going down there. You're in access. Sweet. So I can go down there, probably take over that, and take over Egypt, and that's probably. What is happening to you, Italy? <laughs> oh wow, they lost provinces to France. And I can finally deploy a unit. So yeah. Oh yes, and by the way, I just want to brigade it. On just one. You know what, close, I'll go division and mountain. One needs to be three. Damn. Uh, brigade attachment. Mountain. Okay, sweet. We can change these names, can't you? No. Oh, yes. Like I said before, you must. Like you said before. And like I said before, anyway. The army that you choose for me to make, I'll put it uh, here. 
along this border or along down here so when it starts we can have at least some defense but yeah I expect to be doing access in this episode yeah I do and then after that I can basically drop everything I drop everything, I mean... I drop everything, I mean change everything, basically, so... Yeah, change that to research now. After I drop... No. Nothing cha happening here. Absolutely nothing. Nothing. have that after that stop. But let's go back to industry and we will continue increasing our industrial production. If you have any like hint, uh, tips for me just say like it'd be good for me just say in the comments. It's great to know that you're commenting and uh, telling me like oh you can improve on this and you can do that like instead do this. I'll take it into consideration. They really need to work. But yeah, so... So yeah, now that they're done with Greece, they should be able to come down here and save their arms. Hopefully. Hopefully. But yes, let's see our resource first. I just really... Uh, okay, they really don't have anything besides Egypt. Thirty percent. Okay, okay, let's... Oh, we need 25. Didn't think of it that way. But anyway... Okay, uh, my voice is going to sound so weird in this. Uh, okay. Are you at war with anyone in Japan? Japan. Nope, you're not at war. Interesting. Hope that if when I do join the Axis, uh, what I want to join your I offered. Germany, why? 
need me in this axis to win. Okay. You know what? Yeah, they're not gonna invite us. Damn it! And I had all these plans to go into the Axis and like do all that, but no, it doesn't work like that apparently. Okay, we were at three, and then I can change things around. <laughs> it looks like Bulgaria is our first stop. So, seeing as we've really removed this, seeing as we're not going to be in the war for them, them yet, yet. We could still have all of our units. I always call them units if they're called something else, but battalion. Here. We're not going to give so yeah so in the so seeing as it's nearing the end uh, if, just tell me what you want me to create like what do you want me to build I'll do it anything we fun to see what you use want Neither has the Soviet Union. Hmm, I'm just thinking. I'm thinking, what happens if I do get attacked by the Soviet Union? Whoa. Istanbul HQ. Okay. Wow, a lot of these are connected. Huh. But yes, anyway, so seeing as. Really? Okay then. Okay, let's read this before I go. Germany, destiny, encirclement forced Germany into a war in 1914 and blockaded, a blockade brought her to her knees. Conquest in the East will neatly solve both of these problems, allowing Germany to f fulfill her destiny. Sweet. That means these guys are going to be off the border. Can I declare war? <laughs> well, I've actually dropped that far. Okay, hope you've enjoyed the episode. My voice sounds really weird today, but hope you've had fun. See you in another episode. <laughs>